6 times 10 to the 5 times 12 times 10 to the minus 3, all divided by 4 times 10 squared. Using the properties of fractions, then we can divide out what's common top and bottom. So here, the 4 goes into 12 3 times. And then there's 10 squared, so two of these can come off this. So take away two of those, and we'll be left with three here. So we're left with on the, there's just one on the top, one underneath. So on the top, there's a six times a three, which is 18. And then there's a times 10 to the power, 10 to the three and 10 to the minus three, times you add three plus minus three is naught. Now we want a number between one and 10. So write that 18 as 1.8 times 10 to the one, isn't it, to give you the 18 back times by 10 to the naught, which is just 1 anyway. So you basically end up with 1.8 then, times 10 to the power 1.